show you how to use range in react like this if i drag the range the value is also changing this is value and emoji is also changing right till 50 it's in green color after 50 it's in pink color okay let's start here i already created a react project and also i'm running this project okay i'm going to use this css for a color change okay and yeah let's start now i'm going to create the input I'm going to close that input and type this range range min value is 0 and maximum max value is 100 and also step step is 10 ok save this go to browser here I got a range ok and now I'm going to get the range value so that I'm going to create a state const this is data set data and I'm going to create a use state it's imported here this is data initially range value is 0 okay I'm going to copy this data and go to paste in this value okay and also now I want to get the on change value of this range set data e dot target dot value yeah and also I want to copy this data after this I want to create a h1 tag and yeah this is h1 paste that data here save this go to browser yeah initial values here i give zero so this starting value is zero okay this value is increasing 10 plus 10 plus 10 like this like that okay if i change this step into one means i save this if i go i refresh this page yeah if i changing means value is increasing plus one okay in my case, I'm going to use 10. Now I'm going to change the color of this range. Okay, so class name and if data. Okay, if data greater than 50 means so this high. Okay, else. So this less okay. Save this. Go to browser and refresh this page. Initially it's in zero. Till fifty it's in green color. After fifty it's changed to pink. Okay. Now I'm going to display the emojis. Here I'm going to create a use effect. Okay. If data if this data is changed use use it use effect will re-render re okay so here use effect is imported okay here i'm going to display emoji for if data equal to zero means i'm going to first i need to create one state for uh, emoji okay emoji and this is emoji initially it's in this okay yeah save this and I refresh this and also I'm going to copy this emoji and paste before the input okay this is also h1 or div too small so I'm going to change the style or uh, I can use h1 save this yeah this is fine yeah if data is 0 means I'm going to set set emoji yeah it's already 0 okay so 
if data value is 0 I need to display this else if if data equal to 10 means I'm going to set this okay copy that and paste here like that put till 100 okay okay save this go to browser and I refresh this page initially it's in this emoji if I increase this to 10 yeah value is also changing emoji is also changing yeah this is changing like this yeah this is what I try to tell in this video thank you I will see you in next video bye bye